so we're racing the Arca series here at Daytona. This is probably going to be a complete disaster. Hopefully we can stay in the front. We uh, qualified in pole position. We're in the 16 cars, so we have plenty, we have zero plenty of room. So uh, hopefully we can at least get a top tires, five in this one if we stay out front. But yeah, if it's uh, it's probably going to be a disaster. It's Daytona, and there's always going to be a wreck. Uh, looks like we have some guys starting even in the pits, so don't blame them. I fucked up, Keith. Don't know exactly what he said, but. Why are you getting into the oh, One to go. Alright, so it looks like you're going to be on the inside, I think. I had to see the road close. Line up behind the safe car. Can't exactly make it out okay. what he it's said. Okay, I have a friend. Brian, Brian, we're going to work together. We're going to make it through this, okay? But yeah, it's going to be a disaster. We have a wide range of different numbers up in the front. The one didn't qualify, yeah. along with the three, four, five, six, seven. I'm All in. the lower numbers are the ones that didn't qualify in this one, which is a bit concerning. So we'll see how this all plays out. How big of a field do we have here? 19. 19 cars are in this one, so... Yeah, we'll see what we can do. We're going to try and keep it on this bottom line as best we can. Steering ratio is set pretty low because these cars tend to... Uh, it feels pretty good with a lower ratio and staying in a lane seems to be easier with... Uh, with the stock or the default uh, steering ratio on that so left it all alone hopefully we can hold a nice clean line and yeah come out of this with hopefully a win all right spotter you're right here buddy I'm on it are we going on the green flag on this one don't want to get too much of a jump ahead of them because then they'll just come and free train me anyway, so. Green flag. And we're off, green flag. Try and shift as best we can here. Looks like we get a pretty good run. Pretty good shifting there. Looks like we're able to get a decent little bit of lead here but we all know they're gonna come back especially once that draft comes here and yeah probably not gonna be able to hold the lead here I think the 12 is gonna be able to drop down below us here yep oh he decides not to he decides to not abandon abandon people that are he's working with on that top line so we're still gonna be in that decent position here and first on the bottom yes switch it to relative looks like we did not did not lead that lap from what I can tell but we're pulling pretty pretty well on the bottom looks like uh, the eight is kind of having a little bit of trouble here Band to my back, my rear bumper here. Hopefully he doesn't bump here. We're gonna go and get sent around. Wow, that is a risky move by the 11 there. But we lose that first place position. Not a huge deal really. As long as these guys get plenty of room up here, we should be fine. Nine five, Just gonna try and concentrate as best we can. The biggest problem is getting into that corner. The cars tend to push up, and if you're not ready for it, you can end up door slamming the other car, and that's gonna wreck you. We're right to the back of the 12. Not much closer you can get than this anymore and we're gonna send him into a spin. Still outside. Gonna get pretty close here. Don't know how I feel about this. 
I'm gonna give as much room as we can. And here's that corner. Yeah, there's that push. You see the 12 and the 11 both get pushed up there. Really don't want to get wrecked out in this one. Like I said, if we can get a top five, I'm totally fine with that. Oh, and it looks like the top line sneaks in front of the 12 here. And we have a new leader, the 11. So it looks like the top line's getting the better runs. Now whether or not they can keep doing that, we'll have to see. Ball goes really well on that apron and ends up pushing up pretty high. Luckily everybody is pretty spaced out here coming into these corners and we don't have any issues. Uh, I don't know his number, the 14, he's all over the place there. Yeah, I don't know what's up with this bottom line, we're just not working that well. We're uh, slowly losing positions here, and actually going backwards, so... Don't know exactly what it is, it seems like the top line's quicker, so... We might try and go to the top line once these clear out. I don't know. Now we're going three wide, so we're going to maybe stay on the bottom here. I don't like this. Everyone's giving plenty of room, but you never know. A little... Even... Oh boy, 14's going to... God, he holds on. 14 holds on to it there. I thought he was going for sure. I don't know how he held on to that. I would go to the top line, but I'm kind of nervous with the 14 now. God, we might have a wreck up here. Everyone's kind of dropping back now. Yeah, we're probably going to see a wreck here. Oh, there it is, there it is, there it is, and we're in it. Yep. Awesome. Nice. And I can't even get this thing to move. Yeah, Arca at Daytona is just garbage. This isn't fun. Uh, not when it's just a wreck every time. So, complete waste of a video, probably not even going to upload Speed this boxing, because it's in. boring. It's boring to be Speed lapping boxing, around. In, Five, three, Just lapping two, around senselessly. One. Right here. Oh, of course, why not? Add more to it. Go Mako, go Mako! Go, go!
total trash, so we're all the way in 16th now. One lap down, apparently. Garbage. Got wrecked again. So, I'm just done with racing here. This is total trash, so... Not gonna be, uh, racing here. Unbelievable. We're just probably going to end the video here. If I can, do it while still driving. Okay, we're just going to pull over here. And I'm going to stop the video. It's uh, pretty much pointless. But yeah, thanks for watching everyone, and I'll see you guys in the next one.